How's it going crew? This is Happy Days and welcome back to our Selena the Summoner Expert Mode Let's Play. I'd like to take a chance to say a massive thank you once again for your amazing support for the series guys. We are smashing well over a thousand likes every episode so thank you so much for your continued support and Selena appreciates it too. Alright, last episode we fought some pirates and now Selena is kind of a pirate <laughs> with a lot of spiders. Uh, we made an ocean farm too which will be great for cash throughout our adventure. And we got our spider armor, and now we have our army of little spiders flying around us, which is kind of fun. They're really strong, actually, which I love. So this episode, guys, I'd like to add some more NPC houses, which would be fun indeed. Want to try for the pirate stuff? We'll do a quick little montage of that. And I would like to beat up the Queen Bee and see how quickly spiders can actually take her out to try and get that trophy. And then mech bosses, guys. Are we going to fight a mech boss? I'm thinking we'll have time this episode. You will let me know which one you want me to fight, so that's going to be interesting too. Alright, lots to do this episode guys, let's get started. How quickly can the spiders destroy the queen bee? I'm guessing pretty quickly indeed, and we are about to test that theory. And uh, I actually planted a few hello seeds around the edge of our base here, because the corrupt, uh, not the corruption, the crimson, Seems to have spread into the jungle to the right, uh, which is unfortunate, and it oh no, it looks like it might have destroyed our fishing spot. <laughs> oh no, yep, I'm, I'm thinking this doesn't look too good. Oh no, look at it! <laughs> oh man, oh no, Crimson, why you do this? Oh, it's everywhere. No. <laughs> oh, we're going to need a contaminator for that. <laughs> oh, well. I'll worry about it later. We've got a few summoning potions left still, so we're all good. But we are here to fight some queen bees. And uh, what we can do is actually make some more abominations. And I have a feeling that we're going to take her out pretty quick with these spiders. So let's... <coughs> Sorry, pardon me. Let's make some more abominations. I also brought down the hive walls. Uh, from when we were fighting the Queen Bee uh, the first time, and I threw bombs everywhere. So let's get our buffs on, let's resummon our spiders, and uh, let's see how spiders go against the Queen Bee. And I'm thinking pretty nicely. Uh, I just need to start getting this wall back up uh, from all the bombs from before. So, uh, alright, let's see. Let's see how spiders go. Oh! Oh! They are destroying her! Oh man! Man, that is so good. Check it out. Oh, I forgot to bring my bees ore too, but that's okay. Wow. Check it out. That is so fast. Ho, ho, ho. Man, we're going to have this trophy in no time, people. Oh. So, let's put some more walls on, and let's let these spiders eat lots of queen bees. Oh, yes. Oh, trophy acquired. Very nice indeed. Man, that dropped quicker than I thought it would. But uh, no complaints there. And we got some treasure bags. Always, always fun. Uh, so let's pop these open. Three, two, one. Boom, boom, boom. Whoa. So much bee loot. Bee loot for days. Love it. And uh, I think, yeah, our poor fishing spot. Uh, we're going to have to... Uh, temporarily abandon this, I think. Uh, this is just a mess. <laughs> and unfortunately, Crimson changes mud, which is what jungle grass grows in, into dirt. Uh, so it's not even like I can contaminator it. But you know what? We've got so many summons, we'll probably be okay for a while. And uh, I might try and fix it up later in our adventure. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, well, I'll stop my inventory. We'll move on to our next step. Before we rush too far ahead, uh, I think it's time to add another NPC base slash summon house. So we've got our slime, we've got our hive house. Uh, I'm thinking this little area here is looking kind of cool. And a lot of you suggested for the imp house, like I got a lot of emails saying things like lava and, you know, sort of using the obsidian bricks and all that cool stuff. So I, I'm thinking like we could make like a little pit and I grabbed some buckets of lava and, uh, yeah, we could sort of, you know, have lava sort of dripping in from the sides. Kind of like how you make the waterfalls 
and yeah, sort of play with it like that. Um, so thanks to everyone who sent their suggestions in, they were really, really cool indeed. So all we need to do is, Merchant, you are probably going to die if you hang around here too long, buddy. <laughs> so we're just going to make like a little crater for it. Uh, we've got some hellstone bricks too, so I've got some great ideas in mind. Uh, once again, thanks for everyone's support, and uh, let's get this started, people. Well, hello there, Rupert. You enjoying your hot little house, my friend? Full of impy goodness? Oh, yes. And uh, I managed to fit a room for a weapon rack in there, which is kind of cool. I don't know what I'm going to do with the slime house. I might just put it on the side. Uh, but we're still using our slime stuff for farming, so we might worry about all that business just yet. However, what we can do is finally make a hornet staff, uh, which I still haven't made one yet. And I uh, put some room here so we can put one on display. Oh, yes, very nice indeed. And I thought we could also put our bee armor on a nice little mannequin here. And I fixed the stem of the house to a few people asked me to make it out of hive instead of wood. And I was like, yeah, we can definitely do that. No problems at all. So, uh, what we need to do before we move on to our first mech boss, I thought we'd finish off our pirate farming. Uh, now, I've done a few more in advance. Uh, let's have a look at our loot chest here. Um, so, nothing too crazy. Just got a couple of bits of loot. Um, so, we've got three maps left. I think you got a 1 in 100 chance of getting the pirate staff from, like, uh, Pirate Captain and Flying Dutchman. Uh, and I think it's, like, 1 in 2,000 from normal mobs, which is not the best odds. Um, but you get about 150 pirates in the invasion. So... I mean, we've got three to go. We might get lucky. You never know. Um, yeah, so we'll, we'll give it a shot, guys. We'll give it a shot. Uh, but pirates are probably not critical for us to keep going. I think spiders will be fine uh, for if we fight twins first or whatnot. Oh, also, I meant to say... Ah! I meant to not... Oh, man! Whoa! Holy moly, you crazy pirates! Oh! <laughs> so crazy. Oh, trust a pirate captain would spawn straight away, huh? You better drop me a pirate staff after almost killing me! <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> have I got any buffs? Yeah, I do have some buffs. Sweet. Alright, let's summon our spiders again so they get a bit of boosted damage there. Oh, man, I'd love to get a summoner emblem from Wall of Flesh. Maybe if we get the twin staff, I reckon we could definitely have another go at Wall of Flesh. Try and get that. Oh, demonic colors. Oh man, those crazy pirates, they've done it again. Uh, we did get beat up a few times, but we managed to survive and we got more loot to put into our awesome pirate loot chest. Uh, so we're doing okay, we're getting lots of banners, we got the Flying Dutchman trophy, and I believe last episode we got the Black Lens, uh, which is really cool indeed. Uh, but rare items, we got the Gold Ring and the Discount Card, uh, which is kind of nice. Um, 
We can't quite use them yet. I think you need a gold coin to put them all together. But at least for now, they are very nice. Uh, just to have as secondary items, we might be able to... Yeah, I think we don't need our mana flower at the moment, so that's kind of cool. So let's actually put that into storage. Uh, we've got a mechanical eye drop uh, because we haven't fought any mech boss, so we can get all of those, uh, which is really nice indeed. Now, we need wings. If we're going to fight the twins, we're going to need wings big time. Uh, and that means going to visit good old Wyvern. I don't normally use the leaf wings anymore. Um, you guys like it when I mix it up a bit. Uh, so let's get some more potions. Uh, gravitation to find a sky island. And maybe it's almost night, so let's take one of those. Uh, and that should pretty much do it, I reckon. Alright, so... What, sorry, bunny. <laughs> I might just grab a regen, too, because Wyvern... Uh, Wyvern attacks quick and fast. And he can get out of control pretty quickly if you allow him to. Alright, so let's just throw on our Spelunker for... Uh, our Spelunka potion. Our gravitation. And make our way up to space. And hopefully, there's a sky island nice and close. Oh no! It's a wyvern while we're in the sky! This is terrible! Okay, we can do this, people. Alright, actually, we're near our arena. Will he follow us? Yep! He's gonna follow us! Okay, we have a wyvern battle. It's on, people. Hello, is wyvern still there? Is wyvern... Yep, he's still here! He's still here! Okay, this... Wow! That, that gold ring works amazingly! Holy moly! Okay. Well, seeing we're on the ground, this is actually a lot easier because we can move faster. Um, spiders, stay up here! What are you doing? Get him! Get him, get him, get him! There we go. Very good. Come on, spiders, you can do it! You can do it! Oh, this is probably where we need walls. Uh, I see what you guys mean with the twins. Uh, no, nah, okay, throwing on a potion. Oh, man. Ah! No! No! Oh, what if I stay really low on the ground? Will that help the spiders? Uh, no, not really. <laughs> uh, ah! <laughs> Alright, we've almost got him. We've almost got him. Oh, wow. Okay, yep, got him. Beautiful. And oh, we got the perfect amount of souls of flight. That's awesome. Oh, that's so cool. So we don't actually need to fight another wyvern now. That's kind of cool. I was thinking, uh, Selena, Summoner. I'm thinking maybe some nice natural wings would look cool. Uh, so we're going to try for the tattered wings or the butterfly wings so for that we need to go to the jungle what a nice way to start our hunt for the wing material than to find mr wizard uh thanks for saving me friend this bondage was starting to chafe oh yes uh music box bloody blah, blah harp oh maybe i should get some great of mana or crystal ball or ice rod uh, i'll buy a few of these why not uh we have used them before and there is uh, is that Grubby, that one? Or Buggy? Buggy's 40% bait power. Totally worth it. So while we're looking around down here, we are on the lookout for lots of Moss Hornets or the Moth, uh, which has a 50% chance of dropping uh, the Butterfly Dust, which would be very cool indeed. Um, yeah, so, oh, and any other loot. Uh, I still wouldn't mind some living wood items. Oh, there's a hornet now. Um, I think the hornets have about a one in a bit chance uh, of dropping the, uh, the tattered wings. So, but they're pretty common. So, you know, you think uh, you got a pretty good chance of getting them still. Uh, it's just a, it's a numbers game, guys. We just got to take out lots of them. Ah, it's an Arapaima. No, I'm stuck. Whoa. <laughs> Oh man, oh, I almost died to one mob. And a giant tortoise. We might we might give him some space, I think. Uh, let's see. So, looks like there were some mobs down here. And I've got to be careful, I'm almost dead. Oh man. Uh, yeah, swiftness potion, that's going to help. That's going to help a lot. <laughs> oh, maybe there'll still be some hearts in here. Okay, that was good. Wow, look at this little room. Wow. This is all new area. And let's see what's in the treasure. Another flare gun. Ah, and a jungle rose. How lovely. Actually, that kind of suits Selena. I like that. And a shine potion. That's cool. Ah, no, 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 no. Oh, oh, no, no. Oh, man. Oh, man. We have to block this off. Oh, oh, man. Wow. That got, that got real really quickly. Oh, it's a moth. Sometimes, I think moth's got 50% chance of dropping the butterfly dust. Are we going to get it? Come on, come on, come on. No! Yes, yes, we got it. <laughs> I was like, no! And then it was like, yes. Okay, it looks like butterfly wings are for Selena. 
Very nice indeed. Oh, man. Okay. Let's kill a few more of these. You never know. Might get both. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, unlikely, though. <laughs> There's just so many of them. Okay, let's not die as well. That would be a bit sad. Oh, man. Okay. So, oh, wow. It's the middle of the day. Oh, man. I must have been in there for a while. So, uh, let's see. Let's just get rid of some junk. And uh, we should be able to craft uh, the wings... Which station do I make these at? Uh, let's see. Let's check with the guide. I think I've got everything I need. Uh, let's see. Got butterfly dust. You make them at a mithril. <gasps> no! Oh, no way. I haven't mined any mithril. Oh, no. This is crazy. I didn't even think about this. Ah, spiders. What are we going to do? <laughs> oh, no. I can't make wings. It looks like we're going to have to mine some mithril. Oh, man. I think they need about 15, 16 bars. So, four. Uh, it's about 64 uh, mithril ore we're going to need. Well, luckily, we don't need too much of these special altars. Okay. Cobalt and Ori Kelkim. I might just do two of it. Ah! It's a crimson mimic. Oh, no. Oh, man. Okay, let's fight it. Oh, wow. <laughs> that really blends in well. That was kind of crazy. Okay. Oh, luckily, he might jump straight over us. Oh, oh I'm stuck. <laughs> oh, man. Crazy mimic. <laughs> oh. oh, okay. Okay, I think we're good. Hopefully, he jumps over my head. Yep. All right. Oh, no. No. <laughs> oh, this is so dangerous. Oh. I reckon we can only take like one or two hits from it, maybe three. Um, oh, no, no, no! <laughs> well, isn't that a funny crimson mimic? Oh, ho, ho. yeah, let's tear apart poor little Selena. Oh, well. So what we're going to do, let's make a hellstone, a molten pick rather, uh, so we can mine up this uh, amazing cobalt. And we need not much, to be honest. So let's get on our Shine Potion and our Spelunker. And yeah, oh, there's a little bit of Cobalt. Let's see if we can find a bigger vein. Yeah, there we go. That's much bigger. Um, yeah, I think you only need like a tiny bit of Cobalt for a Mithra, a Cobalt pick. <laughs> and then you only need like, um, and then we only need like 12 uh, Ori Culkin bars for the Anvil. So this is not going to take long at all. Oh, so easy. It's, a, it's so weird, like, I was forgetting all the stuff, because, you know, in a summoner playthrough, you don't really need the hard mode ores, uh, because you pretty much just use summoner armor. Like, we use spider now, and then after Plantera, I think we can get the Tiki set, and then the Spooky set not long after that, so, yeah, like, there's, there's so many different things that you use. Blood Moon, okay, why not? Sure. So let's make some Orichalcum bars. Oh man, it's all happening. And uh, yes, we can make the anvil. Beautiful. And as, as mobs are going crazy outside, spiders eat them. <laughs> and let's see, can we make our wings? Oh yes. Oh, warding as well. Wow, that's cool. Ah, Dripless, what are you doing? Get out. <laughs> oh, crazy things. Oh man, that wandering eye. Okay, got it. Beautiful. Alright, let's put on... Oh, where am I going to put them? Wow. Oh, we can probably live without our gold ring for a bit. Ah, oh, we finally have wings. Beautiful. Oh, that feels good. Very nice indeed. Ah, oh, and look at all the craziness going on. Oh man, this is out of control. <laughs> ah, crazy. There's mobs everywhere. It's out of control. Oh, at least it's nice and quiet here. I don't know, guys. But uh, we got a lot of powering up on this episode. We've got our wings. We are ready to fight twins. So 
Hopefully we don't get destroyed too bad. Our, our armor score is not that high, so yeah, we'll see how we go. <laughs> oh, it's going to be crazy. And thanks everyone for leaving your suggestions for next series. I've been reading through them all and there's some great ideas in there. Uh, special thanks for today's Easter egg shoutouts. We had Leo K who asked for a pink sprinkled donut. And we had Jake M who asked for a Stardust Dragon Staff. If you spotted them both, let me know in the comments. And don't forget to suggest your own ones. Consider smashing that like button if you're enjoying the series to keep showing your support for it. And if you're enjoying the content on our channel, guys, consider smashing that subscribe button to join our happy crew. But here's the most important part, as always. You all stay happy, and I'll see you soon. This is Happy Day, signing out. See ya! No! Oh, why did I go down? Why did I leave the box? Life was good. <laughs> I could have just killed the boss and lived like a king. Oh, guys. It's getting low. It's getting low, but it is shooting like a crazy bee. Oh, man. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Ah, get out. Lorenzo. No, no, I don't want to talk to you. I want you to get out of my secret base. <laughs> Oh, uh, bunny! <laughs> no! <laughs> uh, <laughs>